all right all right so we are back this is part three to the series of the east side of florida new construction homes that i am bringing you guys today we are greeted by rjm homes this is a custom home builder in west palm beach and if you're looking for a four bedroom three bath home with just a wow factor i'm talking about a courtyard and a private guest house suite separate from the actual house this is going to be it for you i really want you guys to understand that this is a total of 42 63 square feet as you guys are going to see this covered entry here is around 163 square feet. And as far as living space, we have 3162 square feet of entire living space. What I want you guys to pay attention is they really do not cut corners as far as the build quality and materials that they offer for you to have within a home. As soon as we look up from here, we can see that they have 14 foot ceiling just in this little nook. Looks like the tray ceiling kind of type thing. In the actual main area of the home from here all the way up, they're bolstering 12 feet of ceiling height. And in all the secondary bedrooms, it is a 10 foot ceiling way way better than any other standard builder is going to do for you trust me and i know you guys see the outside area so i'll give you a little sneak peek before we actually head in to all the details regarding this home i have dimensions as far as every single bedroom and what they actually have to offer all right so as soon as we enter here we have a nice sized dining room which is actually 11 by 15 so keep that in mind and as soon as we make a left from there we're gonna be greeted with a very, very nice, ample sized front office with a nice window, let in some natural light. I know you guys are gonna see a repeated theme of the double doors, super, super tall. You know, I always love that and I love to mention that. The good thing about this custom home builder is that they actually do offer impact proof windows in every single aspect. So you see the bay windows here, they are impact proof. And they also do use spray foam insulation to ensure that your home is as efficient as possible. And honestly, this is not a bad price point. I've gone over a lot, a lot of homes within this similar price point, $650,000, $700,000, even more than that. And honestly, in some cases, if you're able to find a nice size lot and the area actually works out for you, it may be even better to just go custom. So of course we see they have soft clothes here, stainless steel appliances, and quartz countertops all the way around. Super, super wraparound. We have an isolated little uh, nook right here as well. Cabinetry, 42 inches. Now this is more, this is 42 inches times two. <laughs> These are big. These are huge pullout shelves. This model is just amazing. This is the gourmet package, of course. As you guys can tell, you have a nice size. The ceiling height is just what's getting me, honestly. So it's grabbing all of my attention. Very nice sink and a nice chill area. And we are going to get outside, guys. Don't you worry. That is actually a separate guest house that you can actually build attached to this main one for an extra $200,000. And we will tour absolutely every inch of what this home has to offer. Now, let's actually start with the laundry. As soon as we come here, you have ample spacing. We have the sinks here and nice cabinetry. Following the same pattern, quartz, even in the laundry room. This is absolutely amazing. Now let's actually go take a look at the rest of the bedrooms. This is going to be a secondary over here with a pretty standard size closet. This is where we are. This is pretty typical. I won't lie. Um, you guys are going to be pleasantly surprised with the actual master bedroom. And I'm pretty sure that's bolstering over 15 by 21. They converted this to a movie room. This is one of the larger ones and they actually added the extra cabinetry and counter space over here. So I'm telling you, the reason why I'm over here is because I understand that if anybody is looking to relocate specifically from New York, California, even Toronto, Canada, and you have maybe family that lives by the West Palm Beach area and you guys are looking for a nice, nice, luxurious home that could be custom built and you can actually pick what lot and where it's gonna be, this may be a good option. Of course, they got tiling all the way to the ceiling and this stutter pattern holding up really, really nice. All of this is solid. I love it. Absolutely love it. I believe this is actually granite here. I already showed you guys the two secondary rooms. And now shifting from the focus of the main area of the home. This is absolutely amazing. We have one, two, three, four entrances to actually get outside to that courtyard. Absolutely love it. Back here. We are going to be greeted with bedroom number three, I think, at this point. 
I'm gonna show you guys that map so just want to show you where the actual secondary and formal uh, area is gonna be this will of course bring us outside where we can kind of look around but now let me bring you guys to the master bedroom and you guys already know that I'm doing a series over here right after West Palm Beach I'm making my way down to Fort Lauderdale and I'm gonna get you guys even more content of brand new construction available. I believe they have townhomes and very limited uh, availability for single family homes in that Miami Lakes, Miami Gardens area. But this is your main bedroom, access to that pool, super, super nice ceiling design. Guys, I don't think I've seen a nicer floor plan as of yet. And this price point, you're not getting anything like this in Orlando, uh, in my opinion. Um, don't get me wrong. They do have custom homes there. His and hers closet. They do have custom homes, but as far as, you know, what I've seen, this is really unique. I did a similar courtyard home as well. That actually was in Orlando, Davenport Providence community. Um, similar price point, but they didn't have a full size guest house like that. They had a similar guest house, but it wasn't the same size. The lights underneath, that's what it looks like to me. And this is super unique. Free standing tub, of course. Another vanity sink. This is your toilet area. And this is gonna be your hearse closet. A lot bigger, of course. And yeah, let's do the wrap around. Super, super high quality. Wow, this actually feels kind of weird. This, this feels kind of weird. I don't know how I would be able to take a shower with all this stuff. Yeah, it's just kind of. All right, so the camera actually died. Let's get straight back to this. I really wanted to point out to you guys that we have multiple entrances and exits to get to this beautiful, beautiful courtyard area. This is absolutely amazing. I'm sure you guys can see, it's literally frameless, perfectly see-through. And the other home that I did that was a courtyard similar to this, had a similar feel. But honestly, I like this one a little bit better simply for the fact that that guest suite and the inside of this house is a little bit nicer. The other one was a two story, but this is a single and it is absolutely amazing in this West Palm Beach area. Let's take a look at what this actual guest house has to offer. This is an actual house though. When, when they say that this is the guest house, $200,000, you can definitely rent this out. It's literally separate from the home. Um, it's not connected. And this is a little office, a little bit dark uh, lighting here. But this is where we are. Full kitchen set, actually. I'm surprised to see that. They don't have a burner, but I'm not surprised. And they have a full bath. The other one was a little bit tighter, but this feels more like actual, you know, like a, a home. You know, this feels more like actual sufficient area that somebody would actually live in. And you guys already see, boom, you come through here and you're greeted with your actual bedroom. I'm assuming they have this as like a design center. <laughs> so this is actually not bad because now I can show you guys all the design options that they actually will offer you if you were to go ahead and purchase one of these homes. This is the exterior so we can see the, uh, the brick and stone layout that they actually use. This is all the cabinetry, cabinet handles. And these are actually all the cabinets. So level four, the more expensive is gonna give you something like this. So at least you guys can paint the picture to where you're looking at these, all the countertops. Well, we got options in here, guys, jeez. So again, this is custom. You can build it wherever you like. As long as you can find the lot, you can essentially build this entire floor plan the way you see it. Not too many custom home builders that are under a million dollars over here on this side. So yeah, that's pretty much where I'm bringing this to you guys. Like I was telling you, um, this is a series, so straight from here, I'm actually hitting Fort Lauderdale, Miami Lakes, Miami Gardens, South Beach, if I'm able to actually partner with another agent, which I'm working on that, uh, to give me some access to a few of the condos. That would be absolutely amazing. And yeah, I really do hope that you guys appreciate the time that I've taken to kind of show you guys around outside of that Orlando area. Of course, um, I will still be servicing there. Don't worry, I'm not moving or anything, but I'm just showing you guys different options. And you know, I really want to grow my audience to a different demographic as well, so I can, you know, assist you guys and 
provide value through my videos as best I can. You guys know my name is Brandon Polito. The number will be below if you would like to inquire not only on this home, but any other home that you may come across on my YouTube channel or in general. Trust me, I really specialize in knowing all these areas, neighborhoods, cities, like the back of my hand at this point. So I really appreciate you watching this video. Make sure you hit subscribe. I'm trying to get to a thousand. God bless you guys and I'll see you on the next one.